When Farrah Fawcett, the brightest star in Charlie's Angel, left the show, we all thought the movie was set for failure. But Cheryl Ladd came in as Fawcett's replacement. Not only did she stop the show from fading out into obscurity, but she improved the overall ratings from the time it premiered. In this video, we will be looking at the little known facts about Cheryl Ladd and her incredible life story. Cheryl was born on July 12, 1951 in Huron, South Dakota. She was charmed into the music industry at a very tender age and blessed with an angelic voice. Cheryl Ladd could not wait to finish college before going to a music concert with her band. She only joined Hollywood to pursue a music career, but as fate would have it, she could not resist the screens when it called out to her. Cheryl started landing non-musical roles in Hollywood commercials and television episodes, as well as making guest appearances for shows like Police Woman, Search, Happy Days and so on. However, we all know Cheryl Ladd's big break came when she was cast in the ABC's television series Charlie's Angels as Farrah Fawcett's replacement. The screenwriters did a clever job to introduce Cheryl as Fawcett's character's younger sister Chris, and it surprisingly didn't dull the shine of the show. Rather, the practice of replacing angels became adopted all throughout the show's history. But Cheryl continued with the show until it was cancelled in June 1981. After Charlie's Angels, Ladd has made over 40 appearances in made-for-television shows, and she is recognised widely as one of Hollywood's finest. Here are some uncommon facts about her. A twist of fate We all know the story of how Cheryl replaced Fawcett in Charlie's Angels, but what many people might not know was that seven years later, the tables turned, and Fawcett became Cheryl's replacement. The producers of the 1984 made-for-TV movie, Burning Bed, originally offered the lead role to Cheryl Ladd, but she declined the honour for reasons not disclosed to the public yet. However, the interesting occurrence was Farrah Fawcett, who gave her the Charlie's Angels platform to spread her Hollywood wings, was her replacement after she refused the offer. But we all know that being a Hollywood actress was never part of the plan for Cheryl Ladd. Maybe that was why she kept declining movie offers even after Charlie's Angels. Matter of fact, she never wanted to be in Charlie's Angels originally and still maintained her stance even after the show's creator, Aaron Spelling, did all he could to persuade her. Aaron asked me to do it and I said no. I almost got the daughter role on Family. Meredith Baxter and I were fighting over it and she got it and I was devastated, the actress told Closer Weekly. It was not until after much persuasion by Aaron that Cheryl agreed to accept the role on the condition that the screenwriters would come up with something different than Farrah's role. She disclosed that at the time she wanted a funny character. She was a victim of sexual harassment. I was about 19 and I did get chased around one desk, Cheryl told the site. I literally ran around the desk and out the door. Being a Hollywood female sex symbol back in those days meant, among other things, endless attempts by top executives to take advantage of you, and Cheryl was no exception. She had narrated in many instances how she was always asked for sexual favours by irresponsible men in the industry, especially when she was still a teen actress. This is why, for the past 20 years, she has been actively involved in the fight against child abuse prevention and treatment, and was awarded the Child Help Woman of the World Award. Cheryl Ladd has always wanted to be a music star, and Charlie's Angels gave her just the platform she needed. She has released three albums, guest starred in a musical comedy variety series, and had a top 40 Billboard Hot single and a gold record. Today, the singer, actress and writer is a proud mum and grandmother of three. Cheryl Ladd celebrated her 71st birthday a few months ago, and she has an estimated net worth of $12 million, according to Celebrity Net Worth. Now it's your turn. What do you remember about the actress? Do you think Charlie's Angels changed after she replaced Farrah Fawcett? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Remember to give this video a like if you enjoyed it, and if you haven't already, hit subscribe for more videos like this. As always, thanks for watching.